Hello everyone, Sam Kors here and welcome back to the channel. In a previous video, we explored the amazing My Dog Finder, a tool that supercharges your windows with an amazing customizable dog, just like Mac OS. And that brewed up for a good reason, My Dog Finder is a game changer. But guess what? My Dog Finder team hasn't been resting on their laurel and they have been busy adding some new fantastic features to my dog finder which are really more powerful so buckle up and let's explore this feature and at the end of this video i'm going to show you how you can get this for excitingly free to get my dog finder on your computer i've provided two files in the telegram channel all you have to do is to download them on your desktop to get it up and running open my dog finder zip file and extract it on your desktop once you've extracted it open your explorer and here head to document and move this folder here once the folder is here open it up and you are going to see a whole lot of files over here what i recommend you do is to minimize this folder and open themes and pack zip which is also part in the description below open it up you are going to see icons and you are also going to see themes just open it up and you are going to see a whole lot of themes i've provided here for free for you to use so just open each of them up and drag it into the team folder in my dog finder once you are downloading them let's head back and you are going to see icons over here and here i've provided a lot of icons you are i've provided a lot of icons you can use on your desktop so to do that just go back and here you are going to see single icon which is going to take a single icons and here what you have to do is to drag this folder and paste it in my doc finder so once all this is ready just double click on doc 64 to run now you are going to see that my dog finder has been successfully installed and it's really amazing now let's explore the exciting new features in my dog finder the first feature we are going to talk about is this amazing workshop field which is going to take all the teams we've installed on my dog finder and it's really amazing you can feel free to choose any team you want and click on it and click on ok and we're going to see that your dog has been changed to this team and it's really cool look at that this is amazing so i always love to go with this mac os dark team and choose it and click on ok and you are going to see that my team has been changed to this dark one and it's amazing not only that you can just click on it again and also go with this icon and edit once you edit it you are going to see that there's a whole lot of customization features here which you can use to edit your icon to get the amazing new feel of your icon and this is mind blowing look at that this is beautiful so once you have edited successfully you can just click on save and save the team but i couldn't edit mine so i'll just go back to this workspace so it there is exciting new features over here and there are a whole lot of pretty new features which has been added to this dog and it's amazing and when you head to this icon tab you are going to get all the icons you've added to your teams and it's really amazing and with this you are going to get a whole lot of beautiful teams and i'm animations which every team comes with and it's really amazing the next thing we are going to talk about is when we head to this preference tab we are going to see a whole lot of new things which has been added to this team and it's really amazing the first thing i'm going to talk about is the stage manager which when we enable on this display we are going to see this exciting stage management which is going to manage all our apps we are using on our desktop and it's really amazing so feel free to look through and if you haven't covered my previous video which i talked about the basic features of this team just go back and watch the video and it's going to open you with all the old features which are here and it's really amazing and with these new features you are you are also going to have a field which is going to place your hardware status on top of your finder and it's really amazing so i've turned on this process and when i head to this processing tab you are going to see how your pc is consuming all the cores on your desktop and your pc is going to provide you with all the features and cool 
new features on your desktop so feel free to go through all these features and it's really amazing and the next thing we are going to talk about which my dog finder has really improved is this dynamic wallpaper and now at first when you set the dynamic wallpaper it was giving a lot of problems but with this new feature my dog finder dynamic wallpapers work super smooth and amazing so feel free to look through and go back to the previous video and watch and see the new things that has been improved on this team and it's really amazing as always hit the bell icon and subscribe for more tech goodies let me know in the comment below what you think about this my dog finder if you have any question don't hesitate to ask peace out bye bye